Well, you know, many people lost their jobs during the pandemic, and it's meant a huge increase in the number of visits to food banks. Uh, one of the busiest food banks in the city is North Harvest, or sorry, North York Harvest, located at Herb Carnegie Arena near Young and Shepherd. That's where our Mary Weens met Oksana. She's one of thousands of Russian and Ukrainian newcomers living in the apartment buildings near the food bank. She had been working as a cleaner, but lost a lot of work because of the pandemic. Mary Weens asked her what the food bank means to her. It's my first time last uh, year, and it's very uh, nice. People help us and give food, and uh, I um, lost my job Cle- uh, cleaning. Yeah, coronavirus came, and I lost my job because people doesn't want. And other people came to house, you know, and I stay at home and I came to food bank and they give me food and help me all the time. Um, Are you on your own or do you have no, children? Very, I have husband and one children. Yeah, one child. Uh, ten months. Oh, ten months, yeah. you had a brand new baby yeah. last year? Yeah. I so happy, and Canada has like food bank and who can help uh, for us if we lost job, if uh, difficult life. And, and Ella, Ellis, you've gotten to know Oksana over the yes, years. Yes, yes, I met her. Like, mm-hmm. if she needs support, I can translate for her. So many. They so friendly here. You know, I so happy. I so thank you for them all the time a little bit about some of the meals that you that you make using these groceries. What are some of your favorite things to make? Какие продукты получаешь, что ты любишь этих продуктов и как можно что-то приготовить? I like all food and my my husband from in Korea, he likes rice and he cook many foods uh, with rice and uh, Your husband is from Korea? Yes, yes. He's And he's the chef in the family? Yeah, uh, yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, he cook her very well. Oh, you're lucky. I like, it. I like it Korean food and all food what we get in the uh, food bank we love so my family loves uh, i get uh, many food for babies tell me about the baby what do you make uh, the baby is 10 months old eating solids of course right he likes uh, food what daddy do uh, do it you know really? he uh, likes if yeah. his daddy makes yeah. the food yeah he doesn't do like for us like salty I just a baby do it different food yeah. you know and Prepare it separately. Yeah, and to tofu, he likes uh, rice and in other food what we have. It's wonderful. We have food bank uh, who help us. Yeah. It's, it's coming up to Christmas. What are some of your favorite things to to make at Christmas? Yeah, we have uh, my country. We have uh, another food like in Korean, and uh, this uh, Christmas we won't try to uh, food in Korean. Husband said I I made it some special food for Korea. I don't know. He made it me surprise. You're going to have a Korean menu for uh, Christmas. Yes. yes, for Christmas. It would be nice. Last week, la- uh, last year, we had my tradition food. And this year, my husband made it for me some surprise. I don't know what he prepared for me. <laughs> you got a surprise coming. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, yeah, maybe it's uh, my friend will come into Christmas. We can prepare some food my country too because uh, we have different friends, you know, Korean and uh, Ukraine. I'm from Ukraine and who want to eat Korean food, who want to eat Ukraine food, you know, and just... You're from Ukraine. How did you meet your Korean husband? Uh, here in Canada, yeah. How did you meet? Uh, we meet in college when I uh, was studying um, uh, English. <laughs> we meet uh, each other and we married here in Canada two years ago. And I so happy to stay in Canada and um, get some help for food bank. They do it well for people, and they so friendly and so lovely people. And I come into here and say thank you. And Canada prepare like food bank for people. So uh, thank you for all things what we have. 
That was Oksana, one of the clients of the North York Harvest Food Bank, telling the CBC's Mary Weens about what the food bank and its volunteers have meant during a difficult year. Now, our Sounds of the Season campaign for local food banks is on now, uh, on Friday. Be sure to tune in for our special broadcast. Oh, I said Friday. That's tomorrow. <laughs> tune in for the great musicians, a special broadcast, uh, musicians from across the GTA. Uh, your donations make a difference in this year. Those uh, donations make even more of a difference, with so many food banks seeing unprecedented demand. Uh, for more information, go to cbc.ca slash SOTS.